Hello, my name is Alcovar, and today um, a little something, nothing to do with games at all, but I wanted to show off just what I've bought. So, uh, as you may well know, or not know, I'm a huge fan of Jurassic Park and all that. So, uh, I brought this. So, yeah, I bought... Jurassic Park crossed over with Transformers, another classic from the past. And if you disagree with Matt, uh, and disagree with me with that, sorry, I might have had a few pints at the pub on the way here, but you know, that's how it goes. Um, it's like the greatest thing ever. So, uh, I won't unpackage it here. We'll get around to that in a second, uh, and uh, we'll come back to it. So here we are then, uh, we have the car from Jurassic Park here, and we have the T-Rex, the only problem is the T-Rex doesn't actually stand up, he gets a bit drunk, and just completely falls over, so uh, where did I put that gun? I do stuff and then I can't find where uh... do not run with scissors, there we are, I've done some safety stuff, uh, where did I put the gun? Like, don't tell me I've lost it already. Oh, there's... Think I'm in that. The car moves and all that, as you can see. And uh, there is supposed to be a gun on top of it. But for some reason, I have lost the gun. Not even the packaging. Oh, what a surprise! I actually left it in the packaging. Give me a second and... Uh, I shall chop that right out. Come here. Oh, this is dangerous. Come on. Get this thing. Let's have a gun. It's going to cause me difficulties now, aren't you? Mm. There we go. Oh. Come on. Come on, you need it there. That's it. Ah, there we go. <sighs> we have got the gun. Uh, so, I believe... I'm sure, there's a gun that's supposed to go on top there. So, uh... Give me a second and I will be right back. Uh, and we'll see. Just a really quick thing here, the gun does go on top, it does actually slide in, and you can have a gun on top of the car. I know, exciting, right? Okay, I've now, uh, I have now realised that the gun actually fits underneath, uh, where's my camera? Uh, as you can see that. This, well, the gun fits under there anyway, just believe me. Anyway, alright, so now I have to turn these to Autobots. I will not do this on camera because these are the instructions. That's for the car. And this one is for the dinosaur. So uh, I'll be doing those off screen to save some time. So uh, bear with me. And then we have it. Finally, after so long of following these instructions, we have the Transformers. By the way, I do not recommend buying this for children. I remember when Transformers were easy. These are... They look good and everything. Yeah. Hello there! How are you doing? Uh, come on, camera, focus. There we are. Look at him, lovely Autobot there. Um, yeah, the build's good and all that, but uh, when you're transforming stuff... My god, is a pain, especially with this one here, the T Rex. Arr, I'm gonna eat ya, you little bugger. Uh, but yeah, I finally managed to transform. I might transform them back and never transform them again. Um, they were such a pain in the uh, neck, let's say, uh, rather than anything else. But I like them. They're to do with Jurassic Park and all that. And I love Jurassic Park and all that. I'll, I'll buy anything with Jurassic Park. And, uh, yeah, we'll have a look at the back side of him. 
Look at those big meaty thighs here. Oh, yes. Stand up. You stand up better. I can say you stand up better in this form than you do in the, the Tyrannosaurus form. There we are. If we just leave him there for a moment and we'll leave a little bud like here. Pew pew! You're dead, you swine! Uh, yeah, I'm going to leave it at that now. I have been Dark Wolf Art. Thank you very much for watching, and uh, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye! Mm,